13, part one of French for Reading. In this chapter, we're going to be looking at a couple new tenses, the future tense and the conditional tense, which are pretty similar. So let's start off with the future tense. Now, the basic conjugation of the future tense is you take the infinitive and don't drop anything off of it, and then stick on the present tense of avoir using that as a suffix, except for the parts of avoir, the forms of avoir that have an av. So let's see, what does this look like? Je parlerai. I will speak. So it's a future tense saying something will happen in the future. So we've got parler there, and then a, which is the present of avoir for j. And now notice that the r is now pronounced. Je parlerai. Tu parleras. The as is the uh, second person singular of avoir. Il parlera. That's the third person singular of avoir there. Nous parlerons. So that's like, and it's nous avons. We drop off the av and just put the ons there. Vous parlerez. Same thing. And then il parleront. So they all have an r in it, and that. R is one of the keys to recognizing the, the future tense. So basically, the root of the future tense is the infinitive, and it's generally the infinitive exactly for the ER and the IR verbs. Or if you've got an RE verb, you drop off the E at the end. So that means they all have an R in the endings, and the endings all look like the present tense of avoir. So that's a the key for figuring out the future tense of avoir. And they're translated as I will, you will, he will, we will, something. So that's a, a real basic and straightforward uh, translation. So here's a short exercise for you to work on. Write down your answers and check them in the next video.